Face CBS Saturday. case of sleepwalking though sleepwalking of course not don't be ridiculous of course i wasn't sleepwalking well, then what in the world are you doing down here and what in the devil are you doing chatting up the walls oh <laughs> i'm glad you showed up because i was just about to put an apb out on you <laughs> was i gone that long <laughs> only forever what happened, Danny? You have problems falling asleep? Well, let's see. Uh, just as I started reading him his favorite bedtime story, he was out like a light. And then I just sat there and watched him breathe, just like I used to do when he was a little boy. And then I called my mom, and I'm scheduled to see her and Allison tomorrow, so absolutely, under no circumstances, are you allowed to keep me in bed all afternoon? Mm. Only all morning. <laughs> I'll try to keep that in mind. And then I took the best shower of my entire life. Okay, the second best shower of my entire life because you went there with well, me. Well, you could have called and demanded my presence, you know. Mm. Guess I missed my chance, huh? Well, I don't know. Mm. Mm. You kidding me? What the hell kind of sense does that make? We've got victims here, too. Yeah, yeah, so there's nothing you can do. But no, no, listen, I don't, I don't need your apologies. A little justice from the Justice Department, that would be a nice start. I, no, thanks. Rosie! Hey. Look at that beautiful face oh, of yours. You God look bless terrific. you. Oh, that's Dr. Bob is a miracle worker, that guy. You look you. perfect. Thank you. <clears throat> all, all almost as perfect as the love of my life. Oh, oh. that nice. How are you? Very sweet. Good, I thought you would just put me on your pay-no-mind list, but oh, good. No, never. You know, you just missed Paul. Yes! Paulie, yes, I know, and I'm going to meet him later, but uh, after we finish a little, a little business here. Finish a little, a little business? Well, 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 how, how? What, what are you guys talking about? Is there something you want to tell me? We're here to ask you for a little favor. Shoot. Rose and Emily and I would like a little time, a few minutes, with Weston tomorrow afternoon. Yeah. Uh, us. And, and him, you know, a little, um, little surprise party, if you know what I mean. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, but that's completely out of Just the question. Just consider it the final chapter of our healing process, yes, Jack. Because I, I got to slap that low life Weston myself, but Carly and Emily, they did not. And yes, Carly and I got our faces back, and but in my dream, in my dream, the three of us just really finish them off. You know what no. I'm saying? Please, yes, and to the rest of the world, we're looking fine. Everything's on the on the up and up, and dealing with Weston, and that would really put an end to all this. Rest, I can't, please, please. I can't do that. Hey, why not? Because I literally just got off the phone with Washington. Weston's lawyer cut a deal. He's being extradited to Switzerland first thing tomorrow morning. Are you saying that I could be accused of planting that bomb? If the DA feels that the evidence tips in Dahlia's favor, yes. Oh my God, this is unbelievable. After everything that Dahlia's put us through, you're actually gonna take her side? Katie, don't you think if I thought that Simon was guilty, I'd have him behind bars right now? I can't simply ignore the mound of evidence against him. I know, but that's how she planned it. Look, I have a, a victim who shows up here without a weapon, has made no threats what against anyone. Yes, yeah, like... she makes a desperate phone call to 911 for help, and she's the injured party. Hugo, just listen, please, just listen. This whole thing was a setup, okay? It was a setup. Look at me, all right? Hold on, hold on. Just listen to this. She planted a listening device in our home. She shows up here completely out of breath, doing this whole acting thing. It was high drama. She wanted the cops to show up. It just backfired. That's it. I, I understand all of that, and I will understand more after I question Dahlia after she's been... No! I'm going to question Dahlia? Question Dahlia? Oh, good! Hold on! Good. Detective Hughes. I'm, I'm on my way. Uh, Dahlia has had a seizure in the ambulance. What? Is she what? okay? She's, she's been stabilized, but she's in serious condition. Oh, we're not, no, we can, no, we have to go not, with you. We're not oh. going with you. If you're going to question Dahlia, we need to hear it so we can clear up every single one of her lies.
As the World Turns is sponsored by Blockbuster. Enjoy your summer nights with Blockbuster, bringing entertainment home all summer long. Mama keeps our house clean with the magic. Clorox disinfecting wipes, the only wipes with the magic from Clorox, so you're sure they clean and disinfect. Clorox disinfecting wipes. Mama's got the magic of Clorox. We're having Chef Boyardee. Goodness for Chef Boyardee. So have you narrowed it down yet? Yeah, it's between the GE, the Maytag, or the Whirlpool. Or the Frigidaire, or the Amana, or the Kenmore. I'm going back to the TVs. Good thing you've got four days. Sears Big Memorial Day sale with huge savings store wide. All appliances, TVs, and camcorders are on sale. Plus, get 0% financing until October. The brands you want, the guarantees, credit, and service you need. Sears, where else? I went on chemo at the time my oldest daughter was getting married. We had planned everything the fabric, the design, the whole gown. But when it was time to sew the dress, the chemo, it makes you weak. My whole life I've made clothes for other people, but for my own daughter's wedding, I was too tired to make the dress. Are you a chemotherapy patient? Ask your doctor about Procrit. Procrit is a natural way to regain red blood cells lost during chemotherapy, and more red blood cells can mean more strength. Procrit is safe and effective. In studies, only diarrhea and edema occurred more often with Procrit than placebo. Procrit is for patients with non-myeloid cancers. Call now and learn how Procrit can help you get back the strength you need. Your strength for living. In life, you take the bitter with the sweet. But I plan to end up with more sweet. Comfort. It's the feeling your baby has when she's all wrapped up, warm and happy. And Carnation Good Start helps keep her feeling that way. Good Start's the only routine formula whose proteins are broken down into smaller pieces to be easy to digest in baby's tummy. They're called comfort proteins, and only Good Start has them. Think of it as comfort food for the two of you. Carnation Good Start from Nestle. A natural way to lose weight. Is it safe for you? 48 hours tonight. Join Bernadette Peters and Gregory Hines, plus a performance from Oklahoma. It's a celebration for the nation. The Tony Awards, live CBS Sunday, June 2nd. I wasn't chatting up anything. This sword here was falling off the wall, and I was just trying to put it back in its rightful place. But That's why? all. Why? Why? Why are there so many weapons in here anyway? It's not like you have to worry about marauding Huns storming the castle, Ian. <laughs> not anymore, but this room hasn't changed in centuries, Bonnie, and it's never bothered you before. Is everything all right? Fine. Fine, I just... I've been jumpy all morning. Must be the bride-to-be jitters. There's only one remedy for that. Her charmingly disarming husband-to-be. Not until after the wedding. Oh, luckily, that won't be too much longer. <laughs> <laughs> what are all these flowers for? You like them? I love them. Hmm. They're yours. <laughs> Very funny. No, really, what are they for? We're hosting a wedding. Our wedding. But that's such a long way off. Mm -hmm. There'll be stems and dried up petals by then. Oh, I think they should last long enough. <laughs> since the ceremony is tomorrow. Tomorrow? Isn't this splendid? A royal wedding. It's like a dream come true. Ben? Okay, I know what you're thinking. What am I thinking? The bartender called in sick. Lisa called me desperate, and today I am feeling crazy enough to say yes. Just about anything. Well, is that right? Yes. So what can I do for you? Well, you can tell me, is Lisa here? Yes, she's around somewhere. Is everything all right? I got a telegram from Bonnie. She's getting married tomorrow to the Duke. 
She's what? <laughs> I know. I know you're talking about this tacky marriage telegram I just got. As soon as I looked at it, I knew something was terribly wrong. This is not my goddaughter's style. She's better etiquette than that. Yeah, but it's just like Bonnie to make a decision at the last minute. What are you going to do? What can I do? I'm going back to Scotland. Try and change your mind? I'm hoping she'll come to her senses on her own. Well, she better do it in a hurry if she's going to, because I've learned one thing. If you have a choice between a bad breakup and a miserable marriage, the best thing to do is bite the bullet, give the man his walking papers fast. Suppose you have anything for me to eat in this kitchen of yours, do you? What's wrong with this picture? What do you mean? My pictures. My my silly oven mitts. My mug! Everything and anything of mine is gone. Well, what's the story here? And it better be good. Oh boy, she must have done something with She? It. Who's she? The, the, the housekeeper? I guess you're gonna find out sooner or later, so you might as well know now. Yeah. Barbara stayed here while you were missing. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're Barbara? She's not mine. She stayed she here? She stayed here to look after her. Barbara she was living with you in this house? She stayed in Jennifer's room for Pete's sake. What's so hard? Will you please take a look around? Your ex-wife had me yanked away from my life, and then she moves in and tries to erase me from your life, and you're wondering what's wrong? Emily, we'll get new pictures. I'll get you a new mug. I'll get you a whole new set of mugs. And I'll get somebody uh, custom-made you, 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 you your... You think this your, is funny? Your... You think this is funny, Hal? No, I don't think it's funny. And, and, and all that junk, that that's only stuff. It's probably in some box in the attic or in the garage to... You're here, Emily. And I told Barbara a long time ago that as soon as, soon as you came back, that, that this house, it's yours. It's yours. Yeah? Yeah. And I told her that my life is with you now. And nothing is going to change that. Nothing. You really said that? You bet I did. Mm. And I meant to. Mm. Mm. I really meant to. I didn't get all the details, but the gist of it seems to be that if we let the Swiss try Weston for the murder charges, then our government gets information on crucial offshore and Swiss bank accounts. Oh, that's great. That sounds like a really great deal. I wonder how much it cost him. Okay, Weston's gonna walk. I, I tell you what's gonna happen. He's gonna get off a plane somewhere, change his face, change his name. We're never gonna hear about him again. End of story. He's gonna get away with this, There's gotta Jack? be a way to keep him here. Some kind of justice. Okay, listen. Listen, I, I want the guy to pay for what he did as much as you do. So, uh... I'll call some of my buddies at the bureau, tell them to keep their ear to the ground at the Justice Department. That's all I can do, other than going to D.C. and making some ways myself. Well, Jack, there's, there is, uh, something that you can do right, right here, tonight. Tonight. What? <clears throat> Us. Us and him. Nice and spontaneous little surprise party. Just a couple of hours, Jack. Please. Ladies, as much as I would love to help you out, there is nothing I can do to make that happen. No, 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 Simon. I am not letting you barge into a victim's hospital room and start interrogating her. Well, yeah, I'm the detective sister. Well, all the more reason you should know better. All the more reason you should have known better before we got into this trouble. But now, it's too late. You've got to stay out of oh, come on. I know all the questions to ask to get her to trap. Katie, we don't even know if Dolly is in any condition to make a statement. Oh, well, like you said, we'll find out when we get there. No, please. I am not allowing either one of you anywhere near that hospital. Well, you can't say that. You can't order us not to go somewhere. Neither of us have been arrested, and there are no charges against us. Not yet. We can go where we choose. 
You really don't seem to understand that I am an officer of the law. You will not go anywhere near Dahlia Ventura. Yeah, well, I'd like to be able to oblige, Margot, but I've been hit in the back of the head and almost blown up. You know, I don't feel so good. I think I should go to the hospital. Oh, my God, you two are like bugs. You just won't go away. I will drop you off at ER, but you are not to interfere. Who, me? Oh, you. I'll meet you at the car. Simon. You okay? No, I'm terrified. I thought I lost you forever when that explosion happened, and now I am so scared that Dahlia's gonna be so weak and vulnerable in her stupid bed that they're gonna think that you did this. She's gonna make everybody I believe know. that you planted that bomb. I know, there's no telling what she's gonna say. You're right. There's no guarantees. Except for the fact that I love you and that will never change. I love you. <sighs> Let's get out of here. Strength. It comes in a lot of forms. But you might be surprised to find it here in an invisible solid. Introducing a more powerful secret shear drive. All the strength of the solid in a new micronized formula that glides on clear without any white marks, giving you an invisible shield of protection. New improved secret shear drive. Clearly, it's a new form of strength. Strong enough for a man, but made for a woman. At Jones Market, we work a long, hard day, so I need the strongest hold I can get. That's why I switched to Fix It and Free. Nice and crisp. Fix it and free holds stronger, longer than any other free adhesive, even in the hottest liquids. I can have chowder for lunch and fresh corn for dinner. Days are hard, but I've got lots of support. When only the strongest, longest hold will do. Fix it and, and forget it. There's another kind of bounty. Bounty double quilted. It does jobs I never thought a paper towel could do. The quicker picker upper is double quilted. Each sheet is quilted once, then quilted again, making it the strongest two-ply paper towel. It even works underwater. And there are twice as many sheets on a roll. More sheets that can do more jobs than you ever thought possible. Quilted, quick, pick a rubber. Bounty double quilted. La, la, la. Forget scrubbing, rinsing, even adding a separate rinse aid. Now food's dissolved away, leaving only shine. Try Cascade Complete. Skip the sink. Chicken. Chicken. Beef, 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 beef. So that's 99 beef and one chicken. Words out. The taste you love is also a good source of things you need, like iron, zinc, protein, and some B vitamins. Beef. It's what's for dinner tonight. Okay, hey, this is either some sort of bad Scottish joke or... I didn't hear you correctly. Our wedding is taking place when? Uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow. I can hardly wait. Well, can't you try? Never fear. We've taken care of everything. We've notified your parents. You did what? Duncan is delighted. And I've sent word to your mother and godmother in the States. They're coming here. I'm sure they'll do their best. I don't know what's gotten into you two, but something is very, very wrong here. I am not getting married without my mother, and I am not getting married tomorrow. Would you give us a few minutes alone? Garrick, brides have a natural tendency to get a little overwhelmed at this stage, darling. We did not mean to rattle you. The poor thing even convinced herself that there are noises coming from behind that wall. <laughs> that wall? Mm-hmm. You don't say. I think it's time we call the exterminator. Kill the vermin. Or suffer the consequences. It's sort of a family motto, Bonnie. I'm sure that won't be necessary. 
Don't be silly. We can't have the wedding guests dancing around my soul evening. I'll take care of that right away. Carry on, lovebirds. Leave everything in Uncle Garrick's capable hands. Darling, darling. But there is nothing wrong with the walls, Garrick, and I am certain that there's nothing back there. And how dare you tell Garrick that I am overwhelmed and rattled? Ah, uh, you aren't? I'm furious, Ian. With, with me? You're planning the most important day of my life behind my back. Uh, pardon me, but didn't you send me to town the other day to do precisely that while you were prowling around with the family ledgers and, and, and snooping through the dark with Jenkins? I apologize for that. Uh, yes, and I apologize for the behavior that prompted you to leave me, but you can't seem to forgive me. <sighs> Isaac was wrong to come back here and accuse you of nefarious motives, yes. But that has nothing to do with the fact that I don't want to be a part of a wedding ceremony where all you have to do is add the bride and stir. I think it does. It, it, it's obvious that Jenkins has filled your head with all sorts of nonsense marrying me. Who knows? Maybe Jenkins is the one who you've been chatting up behind these walls. Ian! I didn't believe a word he said. But then why did you feel it necessary to do exactly as he suggested? Because it was the only way to prove him wrong. To whom did you need to prove that? To Jenkins or to yourself? To Isaac. Why does it even matter what he thinks? Unless you're still in love with him. Dahlia. Dahlia Ventura. It's Detective Marco Hughes. I have some questions for you. The bomb. There's a bomb. There you I know that someone made a bomb. Yes, to... I know. It's been dealt with in Katie is fine. Where did you find it? What I need to know from you is where you've been all this time you're missing. We found your car abandoned by the side of the road. I had to leave. Simon threatened me. He chased me. He said that if I made any trouble for him and Katie, that he'd kill me. So I stayed away. Why did you come back? For Katie. I had to save Katie. Ventura's room? Yes, she's busy with a visitor. Detective Hughes? Oh, how is Dahlia doing? She's in critical condition. Critical? Thanks. What are you doing? You can't go in there. You can't go in Well, we can sneak a peek. Can you see anything? No, nothing. Uh, I wonder what she's saying in there. Probably more lies, Katie. I just hope she's going to be all right. You're worried about her? No, I'm not worried about her, but if she dies, Katie, I'm sunk. I'm the last man standing and the only one left to blame. Come on, have a heart. Come on, Jack, just a few more Rosie, moments. Rosie, I'm sorry, but I can't. So Weston gets away with trying to destroy our lives, Jack. You cannot possibly think that's fair. Uh, fair? I'm a police officer, Carly. My job is to uphold the law. And even cover for that guy, for that slime ball like Weston? Come on, you just... can't look the other way. Shh. Just this once. This man who tortured us, he's got sent back to Switzerland without even a slap on the wrist, and we don't even get an hour to confront the guy? I'm sure you'd like a little time alone with him, wouldn't you? My hands are tied, Rose. Don't give me any ideas. Hey, look, I'm sorry, I'm sorry if you came here thinking you guys could, could be avenging angels or something. I, I can't let harm happen to a prisoner when, when he's in my protective custody, under my supervision. Unless... Okay, listen, if Weston were handcuffed and brought into the interrogation room and a person or persons unknown got to him while I was otherwise occupied, I guess that isn't anybody's fault, is it? Now tell him what might happen in a situation like that. Let me out. Not so fast. You know, all for one and one for all. You know, Emily's gonna want to be a part yeah, of this. You're right. Thing. You're right. We need, to, we need to get Emily. And so we, we need do. to pick up some supplies. Oh, listen, listen, ladies. Even if I knew what you were talking about, I wouldn't want to hear about it. In fact, I never even saw you here tonight. Ah, uh, Jack. Just when I thought I couldn't love you anymore. <sighs> you're top notch there, Snyder. <laughs> Thanks. Let's go get Avenging Angel number three. Let's.
know when you're not feeling like yourself. You're tired all the time. You may feel sad, hopeless, and lose interest in things you once loved. You may feel anxious, can't even sleep. Your daily activities and relationships suffer. You know when you just don't feel right. Now here's something you may not know. These are some symptoms of depression, a serious medical condition affecting over 20 million Americans. While the cause is unknown, depression may be related to an imbalance of naturally occurring chemicals between nerve cells in the brain. Zoloft, a prescription medicine, works to correct this imbalance. When you know more about what's wrong, you can help make it right. Only your doctor can diagnose depression. Zoloft is not for everyone. People taking medicines called MAOI shouldn't take Zoloft. Side effects may include dry mouth, insomnia, sexual side effects, diarrhea, nausea, and sleepiness. Zoloft is not habit forming. Talk to your doctor about Zoloft, the number one prescribed brand of its kind. Zoloft, when you know more about what's wrong, you can help make it right. By Ocean's Eleven now on DVD and video. Take home George Clooney. You're either in or you're out. Brad Pitt. Exactly. Matt Damon. Andy Garcia. And Julia Roberts. You're a thief and a liar. I only lied about being a thief. Ocean's Eleven. Buy it now on DVD and video. Need to refuel? Try a new Reese's Fast Break. Milk chocolate, soft nougats, Reese's peanut butter. Go, 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 go! New Reese's Fast Break. Refuel and go. ready for a most welcome surprise for babies of every conceivable size. Get incredible stretch in all diaper sizes, only with Huggies Supreme. Comfort stretch sides designed for a fit that's just for you. Huggies Supreme diapers for little babies and big ones too. Our ultimate stretch for all of you. Thanks for making a leave. For almost five years, I often had a hard time walking. I went from doctor to doctor and even had surgery on both knees. Most pain relievers worked for a while, then quit, and the pain came back. Finally, a doctor suggested a leave. Soon I could dance all night again. A leave can stop pain all day with just two pills. It would take eight Tylenol to do that. Now people say I'm a walking advertisement for a leave. All day strong, all day long. Stars Clint Black, Jessica Simpson, Lone Star, the phenomenal Mark Anthony, and the one and only Celine Dion. Cuba Gooding Jr. hosts an all-new special and salute to our troops from the aircraft carrier Harry S. Truman. Rockin' for the USA, CBS Saturday. At Jewel, it's the way we slice, cut, trim. Not just our steaks, but our prices, too. Like summer shockers for Memorial Day. Save on Porterhouse or T-Bone Steak, $3.88 a pound. Use your preferred card for Pepsi, 7-Up, RC, Diet Rider, Coke. Two cases are $8.88. California cherries, $1.49 a pound. And whole watermelon, $3.49 each. We cut prices every week on your favorites. All fresh to your family from Jewel. It's Thoroughbred Racing Action, Fridays through Tuesdays at Hawthorne Racecourse, May 5th through June 4th. Don't miss the thrill of live horse racing this spring. It happens today. Hawthorne Racecourse, it's the only place to play. When you're looking for that ooh-ah feel, come to Mattress Giant. Save up to half off a new Simmons Serta Spring Air King Coil set at Mattress Giant's Memorial Day Sale. Queen sets start at just $259. Get that ooh-ah feel with all the brands you trust on sale at the guaranteed lowest price. Only at Mattress Giant. Ooh-ah. Only at Mattress Giant. Ooh-ah. An upscale winery with a new twist at five. It's Broadway's night to shine at the Tony Awards. Live CBS Sunday, June 2nd. And 
family, Stuart, don't mm -hmm. you ever, ever disappear on me again, because I can't live without this. Oh, really? Keep that up. I may never want to get out of bed again. Mm -hmm. I think I could live with that. <laughs> hey, we never did get around to anything to eat, did we? No, you are the only bite I've had since I've been home. And tasty as you may be. I need food. Okay. You know what I want. Mm -hmm. What? Mm. I don't know what you want, but... What do you feel like? I want something raw. Mm -hmm. Almost alive. Animal. Mm -hmm. Got that? Mm-hmm. Mm. I know just the thing for you. Oh, really? Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> Excuse me. Give me, give me three minutes. Give me three minutes to murder and dismember the both of them. And then we will come back and finish what we started. Deal. Stick to it. Hey, what? hey, hey. Oh. oh. <sighs> Hello. 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 So sorry to interrupt this happy homecoming. Uh, yeah. And believe me, I'd much be rather doing that. I mean, with Paul. But this is a life and death situation. Rose? Yeah. You look fantastic. Oh, yes, say that those three words over and over again. Many times yeah, we don't have again. time for that, Emily. Thank you. We need you now. Yeah. Oh no 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 nothing nothing you two cuckoo girls could I'm say sorry. could drag me away from the man. Oh, I yeah, love how about this? Home. How about this? Weston is going to be heading out of here tomorrow. Yeah, he cut a deal, and tonight is the only night we can give him a proper goodbye. You uh, took the words right out of our mouths. And come on, we'll change in the car. Let's go. Only if I have 100% assurance they're all going to be completely safe. Oh, 100%. I swear, the guy's under lock and key. How can you pass it on? <sighs> See you later. Anyway, I've got something around here I kind of want to attend to anyway. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Oh, Come on. Do you? <laughs> be quiet. Go on the steps. The baby's sleeping. <laughs> Hello, Kim. Hi, it's Hal Munson. Oh, oh yeah, oh, it is late, sorry. <laughs> uh, but listen, I had an idea, and I was thinking about something you might be able to help me with. Jess, what happened? Same thing that happens every time I try to call Bonnie. Ian's uncle says she's not available. Oh. She's probably still angry at me for grilling her about this marriage in the first place. Yeah. Sounds to me like she's bending over backward to keep you from changing her mind. Well, too bad. I'm more than happy to fly back over there and try again. Now, if you don't want to make the trip, I understand. What are you talking about? This is my goddaughter. Of course, I wouldn't miss this for anything. I'm just wondering what in the world has happened to Isaac. Yeah, what is, what is going on with Isaac? I just hope that maybe since I haven't heard from him that he and Bonnie had gone off to some beautiful island and they were madly in love. I just can't believe you haven't heard from him yet. I haven't even had a chance to tell him about Jake. I mean, not that I expect him to stay in constant contact, but it's getting a little strange even for Isaac. Did Bonnie mention Isaac to you when you were over there? Every time I brought him up, she'd get upset and change the subject. Hmm. Well, I wonder if Billy knows anything, but then, Billy, I haven't even heard from him since he went to Scotland, and I certainly don't think he's back. Well, I'm going to try to call Bonnie again before I fly out of here. If I talk to her, I'll ask her about both of them. You know, that may not be the best idea, especially if she's freezing you out about her marriage. Bringing up Isaac is the last thing that you want to do. You know, Lisa, I hope your bartender has a quick recovery because I'm going to Scotland. I mean, you know. Jessica's gonna have her hands full with Bonnie and check on my brother myself. Why do you turn every disagreement we have into a debate about Isaac? You're the one who's rushing us into a marriage. Oh, how cruel and heartless of me. I, 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 I want to spend the rest of my life with a woman I'm in love with. I ought to be drawn and quartered. Oh, please do not oversimplify this. Oh, is it so impossible for you to understand why I might be jealous when, when every time I try to prove to you how much I love you, one of your American buddies does his 
Level best to undermine us. First it was that Billy Boy, and then it was Jenkins. I don't have any control over what they do with their lives. Well, I'm starting to have serious doubts as to whether or not you want to go through with this marriage. You cannot surprise a bride with a wedding, Ian. It makes her feel like she doesn't have control over anything. What about what I want? I thought I was what you want. Uh, look. All we need is each other, our families, and our love, and we'll have that. The important people in our lives will be here to share the day as we pledge our hearts to one another. The rest is just decoration, Bonnie. Maybe you're right. Maybe. <laughs> Doesn't sound too reassuring. I do want to marry you, Ian. That's a relief. It's just that I need to know that this is, this is it. This is forever. That we're going to be together for the rest of our lives. Yeah, well, I'm sure that's somewhere in the vows. I'm joining my life with yours. But if you break my heart again, Ian, I don't know what I'll do. Bunny, you have to know by now that you can trust me. I do. Yeah, but... You just don't trust us, do you? You just don't know if you still believe in us. Is that right? Well, look, Bonnie, if you have any doubts about this now, we're doomed. So, I'll just, I'll ask you once again. Do you want to marry me? Where did you hide all that time you were missing? Motels, bed and breakfasts, sometimes inside the car I rented. You were in your car? Well, I had to keep an eye on Simon. I even bought a listening device and planted it in the house. You admit to that? Of course, I, I had to know what Simon's next move was going to be. And thank God I did or I never would have heard about the bomb. And what did you hear? He was ordering all kinds of different materials. I heard him on the phone. You know the ingredients for making a bomb? What else would you use that stuff for? Why didn't you come to the police? Would you have believed me? Go on. Well, I knew that tonight was the night. I thought if I could get Katie alone, I could convince him to get away from Simon. But she wouldn't listen to me. He has to be stopped. You have to find some way to put him away where he can't hurt anyone else. Right now, I'm more concerned about the charges against you. There's fraud, faking your disappearance, trespassing, breaking and entering when you planted the listening device, assault, the attack on Simon. Now, these are just the high points. How can you protect him? What, because you're his sister-in-law? Well, you know what? I used to be his sister-in-law, too. And what do I have to show for it, huh? A headstone and memories. I mean, what is it going to take for you people to lock him up? And what, does somebody have to die before you pay attention? Dolly? Dolly, uh, Dolly, what? Nurse! Nurse, what is going on here? Do something. What is going What's on going here? On? I don't, I don't know. Go, go, go find a doctor. Don't. No, no. No, you can't let her die. Please, please don't let her die. Lose something? Like that first day shine of your hair color? Then time for something new. Ta-da! New shine extending superior preference from L'Oreal. Now my glorious color that won't fade out has built-in shine magnifiers that won't dull out. Plus six weeks of deep conditioning. Browns stay richer, reds more radiant, blondes more brilliant. We all pass the shine magnifying test week after week. This is big news. New superior preference from L'Oreal Paris. Fade resistant color that shines on and on. Because you're worth it. Irresistible Hellman's at its best. I have to go now. 
If you've always got to go, ask your doctor about Detrol LA. It's been proven effective for overactive bladder. You need a break? Not right now. You shouldn't take it if you have stomach, urinary, or glaucoma problems. The most common side effects are dry mouth, constipation, abdominal pain, and headache. And I don't have to go right now. Detrol LA. When you've always got to go. It's tough not having a car. With immediate claim service, GEICO gets you back on the road fast. GEICO. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Hand your kid a Nestle drumstick, and they're not growing up too fast. They're just a kid eating a drumstick, like you were once. Nestle drumstick, the original Sunday cone. gets it out. Sunday, the true story that inspired the world. Do you believe in heaven? Yeah, I suppose I do. It was a dream vacation to Italy until the unthinkable happened. Nicholas! We wish to donate Nicholas's organs. Jamie Lee Curtis. This is a young man who received the heart of your son. Nicholas's gift, CBS Sunday. When the most beautiful women in the world gather together, one will conquer the universe. Join music superstar Mark Anthony, the Miss Universe pageant, live CBS Wednesday. Why am I sleeping here tonight? Well, I can't imagine you wouldn't be anywhere else right now. Remember me? Dad! <laughs> Good to see you. Good to see you. So you're home now? You Suitcases home. and all? You bet I'm home, suitcases and all. I am home to stay. Yes! Yes! Why is it a secret? There's a surprise waiting upstairs for you in the bed in your room. Surprise? Yeah, go ahead, check it out. Shh, 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 quietly. <laughs> well, I'm so glad to see you back oh, where you belong. That makes several of, of us come. Several of us. So who's sleeping upstairs? <sighs> Daniel. Oh. Emily's back. Barbara brought her back. It's yeah. not, it came, it's... A really long story. Yeah, I, actually, I know I heard some of it from Tom, but he, he didn't know anything about Stenbeck. Did anybody find him yet? No, not yet, but that's just a matter of time. Mm -hmm. Kim, I have to ask you, does Will know anything about Barbara? Oh, no, we we just thought it was better for him to hear from his dad that Barbara had to go back to jail. Oh, thank you so much yeah. for not telling him. It's, tonight's about homecoming, so I, I, I think I'll tell him at another time. Of course, of course. <laughs> hey. It's Daniel. Yes, it's Daniel. But I Daniel. couldn't ask him any questions because he's sleeping. Mm -hmm. Is Emily back or something? Emily is back. <laughs> Excellent. Where is she? <laughs> oh, she's had... She had a go running errand, but she'll be on soon. It's pretty good news, huh? Kind of like Christmas. Oh, man, this is way better than Christmas. It's way, way, way better than <laughs> okay. Christmas. Okay. All right, I'm going to leave you two alone to celebrate Christmas. All thank right. Thank you. Kim, thank you so much for everything, oh, everything you've done. Oh, my friend. It's my pleasure. Thank you. Good night. I'll see you later, pal. Thank you. Thank you. Good night, honey. It's being a gentleman. You know, I probably should have let you sleep, but I just couldn't wait to see you. I'm glad you didn't. And I know it's late and everything, but uh, would you by any chance be hungry? Want to raid the fridge? Now you're talking. Come on. <laughs> you busy? You need something? Uh, yeah, bring Weston up to the box for me. I want to question one more time before he ships out. Consider it done. Thank you. Hey, say, you, you know Norm's Gas and Go on Route 39? Sure. Yeah. Oh, well, if you're done with Weston, why don't you head out there and grab us some of those bear claws? That place is 35 miles away. <laughs> yeah, and those bear claws are worth the trip, man. Here, grab us all a dozen of them. Go, go, go. Why don't you get that prisoner? I want you out of here. Go. reports for me your typing stinks redo them all go 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 go
Margo, what happened in there? I, I don't know. I was questioning her, and then she went into a convulsion. No, I mean, what did she say about Simon? I guess what she's been saying all along, that Simon is the killer, and that everything she did was to protect oh. you. Okay, well, what did you expect her to say? Huh? She thought she could frame me for murder, but we got in the way. You can't believe her, Margot, please. Well, that's her story, and she's sticking oh, to please, it. Oh, please, Margot, please. You cannot take her word over mine. Right, we you will just... get to the bottom of this, Simon. Trust me. Okay, well, you can start by going this. in there and questioning her until she cracks. She already cracked, Katie. She had a seizure. Yeah, fine, okay. When she gets better, if she gets better, whatever, just, I'm sorry, I do have a heart. Yes, fine, of course you do. When she stabilizes, I'll get the DA down here and we'll go at it again. In the meantime, I'm gonna have to try and piece together uh, from the time she came back here, from the time she was missing. She couldn't have, she has to have tripped up somewhere along the line. We just have to figure out where and where. Oh, excuse me, excuse me. If she's stabilized now, Miss Ventura, I do have a few more questions for her. I'm sorry. But you can't not let my sister go in there. She's a detective. I'm she has sorry, to ask questions. But she's gone. Miss Ventura has passed away. On June 7th, get ready to celebrate three generations of laughter. Friendship. I'll knock you into the middle of next week. I will kick you. And secrets. What are you, some kind of saint? That's me. That can only be shared between mothers Mama? and daughters. I am so tired of her teachers. Divine Secrets of the Yaya Sisterhood, rated PG-13. Starts Friday, June 7th. This thing is so uncomfortable. It's a beautiful thing. Crayola Color Wonder Markers. Color only on special paper. So your kids can express their creativity. More often. In more places. <laughs> with less mess. <laughs> Everything okay down there? Crayola Color Wonder. Yeah, fine. The power of creativity. It starts with Crayola. Oh. Fact. Food that sticks to your ribs also sticks to your kitchen. So clean up with Lysol Heavy Duty Wipes. Hmm. Fact. Go to Lysol.com for free money-saving coupons. Life demands Lysol. That's a fact. Looking for a quiet moment? Get a quieter cookie. Soft, fruit, chewy Fig Newtons. Time out from the everyday crunch. Of course, I measured them. Hey, what were you thinking about for the client lunch today? I'm thinking a frosty beer and a natural Angus burger. Stop! Let's think of something a little more appropriate for a business luncheon, shall we, again? Hey, what were you thinking for the client lunch today? I'm thinking a frosty beer and a natural Angus cheeseburger. The Friday's take on working lunches? Keep business casual with a beer and our natural Angus cheeseburger. Eat what you love, love where you eat at Friday's. Margot says she's found a safe way to lose weight. So how much have you lost? 107. Wow. But there's something you should know about this popular natural diet aid. And it's not just women who want to look great. The secrets and the price. 48 hours tonight. I know it was completely wrong of me to go snooping behind your back, but I just can't stand for there to be secrets between us, Ian. There won't be, Bonnie. But there were. Before. And I don't want to be the kind of woman or wife who goes searching through her husband's pockets every day, dreading the night that he doesn't come home. It's my fault. And I hate that I've hurt you, but I want to devote the rest of our lives to making it up to you. And we have the rest of our lives to do that, which is why I don't understand the the rush to get to the altar. You call it a rush. I, I, I call it making up for lost time. I, realigning the stars in the universe. 
If, if I'm behaving like a madman, Bonnie, it's only because I'm desperately in love with you and I'm desperate to spend the rest of my life loving only you. My one and only Duchess. Just marry me, Bonnie, tomorrow. I promise you I will never give you cause to worry again. All right. Tomorrow it oh, shall be. Brilliant! <laughs> <laughs> Put me down. No, never, <laughs> never. I'm never putting you down again. Your feet will never again touch solid ground, I promise. Okay, now look, I, I've given Paddington a full list of instructions. First, mm -hmm. he's to take you to the salon, <laughs> then to the dressmakers. Whoa, you have thought of everything, oh, haven't you? Oh, Bonnie, everything, everything. I should have never doubted you. See, now there's the Bonnie I know and love. All right, then. I better get ready. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow, I'm getting married. <laughs> this time tomorrow, you will be Bonnie McLaren, Duchess of Glasgow, my wife. she's actually dead part of me wants to cry and the other part of me just wants to finally breathe again like maybe this is finally all over no Katie it's just the beginning isn't it Margaret we'll know more after I put the pieces together in the meantime Simon I'm just glad Tom's a lawyer Back, I was wondering, you know, if you're not doing anything like working or something the week over the weekend, <laughs> I was wondering if you wanted to come to my little league game. You bet, wild horses couldn't keep me away. And you know what? Even when I do go back to work, I'm not better than you are. Even when I do go back to work, I'm gonna be in those stands, I'm gonna be cheering you on. <whistles> Will Munson, Will Munson, batter, 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 batter. Yeah, yeah, you bet. <laughs> Hey. Something wrong? Well, I almost forgot about Mom. What's gonna happen to her? What do you say we have a good time tonight and shoot some more hoops and worry about that one tomorrow? We'll open up. Come on, I want to go for three. <laughs> All right. All right. I can take the prisoner from here. Can someone tell me what this is all about? You know, uh, this might be a good time to uh, run that errand we discussed earlier, and you you take your time, Slocum. What's this about, Detective? Well, this is all about you, Doc. Yeah. I'm sure that you know by now I'm being extradited tomorrow. Yes, I hear. Congratulations. Right this way. Like the interrogation room? Look, I've got nothing further to tell you. Yeah, but there's something some people want to say to you. Think of moving Weston. You're not going anywhere, Weston. You like her face? Yeah, it's a work of art, no thanks to you. I bet you never thought you'd see me alive again, huh? Life is full of surprises, isn't it? Too bad we had to find out the hard way. You know what, girls? I feel like celebrating. What do you say we break out the refreshments? Oh, yes! We have a tasty and revolutionary new beverage we want you to enjoy. Yes, look at this. We made it just for <laughs> you. Oh, gee whiz, girls, I hope we got the recipe right. What, what's in that? I don't know. Let me see here. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Double, right. double, toil and trouble. Oh, you know, eye of newt, toe of frog, maybe some cleaner of drain. <laughs> now either you can drink it or we can find another way to get it in you. Choice is yours. Well, you know what those Boy Scouts say. Be prepared. Stay away from me with that. 
Oh, 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 I'm sensing a no. I don't, it sounded like a no to me, Emily. Carly. Now, I know that this, these girls were more experienced with this, but you're a big boy. I'm sure you can take it all. <laughs> uh huh. Come on. Come on. Open up. Open up wide. You don't get away with this. Oh, no? Hmm? No, Doc? Who are you going to call? The cops? <laughs> so open wide. Oh, you can do it. Come on. Say, yeah. Am I employer?